The community and the student body was challenged to come up with an idea for our school that would provide educational opportunity for both our students and the community. And a uh, winning idea was Rebecca Estrada's and she had thought a community garden would be something that would benefit uh, the students and uh, the community around it. We grow uh, different produce based on uh, the seasonality of uh, the crops that we're working with at the time. During the cold weather, we'll usually grow some green leafy vegetables, spinach, kale, chard, lettuce. So let's take all the garden vegetables, cheese, we got everything we got, take them to the food truck. We don't eat right, we eat everything that probably the doctors say that we shouldn't eat. And I think the garden has opened kind of our, most of our eyes and said that we should really limit what we eat because that could cause problems um, when we grow older. This wouldn't have been possible without the Paso del Norte Community Foundation. They've been involved since the beginning and they're involved to this day. The resources that we've been able to secure, manpower, materials, uh, financial resources, those have all been made through, through the Paso del Norte Community Foundation and we're very grateful for that.